Hello, my name is Joel Windsor. I am the project manager for MusicFestivalSuite.com. This year, we did some changes to Music Festival Suite so that when you can't have a live, in-person festival, you can operate a video festival instead. One of the pieces of feedback that we received was that delivering adjudicator sheets to adjudicators was a challenge, and then receiving responses from those adjudicators written out onto those sheets was another challenge beyond that. We have made some adjustments most recently to musicfestivalsuite.com, and this video will demonstrate those changes. In an adjudicator's profile, they can access the registrations they are responsible for adjudicating through their menu, and clicking on any class that they are responsible for adjudicating, they will see all of the video submissions that have been sent in for them to adjudicate. At the top of the list, is their own video response. A different tutorial video is available for that one. Scrolling further down, you will see every video that has been submitted for this particular class that this adjudicator is responsible for. New Music Festival Suite as of right now is the adjudicator sheet button which appears beside the piece, title, and information underneath the video. This adjudicator sheet button will only be available if the festival administrators have made the schedule views active. So festival administrators make your schedule views active so that your adjudicators can see their adjudicator sheets. Clicking on this button will open up the adjudicator sheet for this class. Once you've clicked on this button, you will now be able to see the adjudicator sheet for that particular registration. An adjudicator can then choose the download button inside their uh, their browser which is usually where the PDF will show up and download it and save it to their drive however they see fit. At this point in time we'll let Bill explain how the adjudicator can then fill out the adjudicator sheet right on the computer. What I am going to attempt to do in this video is to show you how you can add text to a PDF document. So what I've got here is I've opened a, a sample adjudicator sheet from Music Festival Suite and I'm going to show you how to add text to that PDF document. Um, first of all, note that it's Adobe Acrobat Reader DC. It's not the pro version, it's just the DC version. So you can download that from the Adobe website. And um, essentially once you have your uh, document open in Adobe Reader, then there is a little um, icon up here that's actually a fountain pen head that allows you to edit or sign a document. And so what it does is it makes a, initially makes a copy of the PDF that it is allowing you to add text to the, to the document. So under here we can just click anywhere you want to add a line of text and simply click to create a text box and then type whatever sample information you want. And when you're finished that, if you want to add another line of text, you can uh, click off to, to disable the text box and then create another text box and uh, type more information if you want to. Again, it's just a matter of uh, clicking the text boxes so we can actually even go in and edit information that we've added previously. And there you've added text to that uh, PDF document. So now the other thing you can do, like here is the adjudicator signature. Um, for those who have created a digital signature, you can add the signature to the document and set it all like that and then we'll go about saving it so then you'd save your document to uh, your hard drive and it'll save all the information you typed in there and you can edit or email it or post it or do whatever you want with this document save it and um, then you'll have your pdf with your edited text in there i hope this helps this is a minor change we've made to Music Festival Suite that we think will have a major impact on how you operate your video festival this year. We hope that this continues to be the resource that you need to operate your festival, even in a pandemic situation, and we thank you very much for continuing to use our services. Thank you very much, and have a wonderful day.